The Illinois Supreme Court has overturned actor Jesse Smollett's conviction for lying about a staged hate crime in 2019. The former Empire actor had been convicted of staging a racist and homophobic attack against himself in downtown Chicago. The incident happened in January of 2019. Smollett, who identifies as a black and gay man, told police two men assaulted him while shouting homophobic and racist slurs. Prosecutor Prosecutors allege Smollett paid the two men, who happened to be brothers, $3,500 each to help him stage the attack. The brothers even testified that Smollett gave them lines to yell, including references to then-President Trump's Make America Great Again slogan. I am not suicidal. If I did this, then it means that I stuck my fist in the fears of black Americans in this country for over 400 years and the fears of the LGBTQ community. Police launched a massive search for the suspects after Smollett claimed the men also tossed a noose around his neck. Prosecutors argued the attack was staged because Smollett was unhappy with the studio he was working with and their response to hate mail he received. Smollett was initially indicted on 16 counts of disorderly conduct in March of 2019, but the Cook County State's Attorney later dropped the charges in exchange for him forfeiting his $10,000 bond and completing community service. A special prosecutor refiled the case, leading to a jury conviction on five counts of disorderly conduct in 2021. Smollett was sentenced to 150 days in jail, but served just six days before being released pending his appeal. Thursday, in a 5-0 decision, the Illinois Supreme Court ruled that Smollett had been wrongfully charged after entering into a non-prosecution agreement with the Cook County State's attorney, a violation of his due process rights, saying the initial charges should have been honored. The court has remanded the case to the lower court to formally dismiss it, ending years of legal and public controversy over the case. With Straight Arrow News, I'm Kennedy Felton. Download our app for updates on this story and many more.